Oh, hello. Welcome to Quackalope. I was in the middle of a bro. You can't start there. Yes, the I perfect can. Time no, you can't start there. That's exactly. Deep strike. breath in. I was that's, exhaling with a. That's a muskrat. That's a dog. That's not. I'm a raven. We're not. We're not starting. You told Keep me I could start. Confidently. You told me here I could start. <laughs> nope. All right. We are doing a game play of Flamecraft. Yes, Flamecraft. This is going to be by Cardboard Alchemy. This is going to be their newest game, either soon to be or already on Kickstarter. Link below and of course this video is time stamped oh. because we're all kinds of professional now. I believe there is a strong chance that this video is coming out before Kickstarter actually launches. Ooh, I said soon to be or now. And with that being the case, I, and I'm not sure if it's on Kickstarter or GameFound. At this point, I'm never, I'm never 100% sure. That's a fair point. It's yeah. online. It's online. There's a link at the very top of this video description directing you to where you can follow along with this game. Yes. Oh, that's so cute. I'm reading the titles. The titles of Dunkin' Dragons? Dunkin' Dragons. Dunkin' Dragons. <laughs> Do you like dragons? Dra Draco Bell. Do you like fiery creatures that burn villages to the ground? Yes. If you said yes, then you'll also like Flamecraft, which are fiery creatures that instead help around town in doing their very best to make everything more efficient and magical yeah. and substantial. Specifically, a cappuccino dragon. Yes. That, its entire purpose is to make warm your cup of cappuccino. Where do you see a cappuccino well, there, dragon? I'm sure, there's, I'm sure it's going to come out. I think it was one of the most famous things. So if you're not familiar with Flamecraft already, Flamecraft is going to be an art style uh, invented and created that sort of blew up. It took these dragons that we see as mythical creatures and brought them into the real world. What if dragons, little dog-sized creatures, existed in our day-to-day -day and were intelligent enough to take part in activities? I'm going to have him read the flavor text in just a moment, but we're first going to set up and allow Sender to give you a 60-second sprint I have no time. Of time I left my phone, too. I got a timer. Okay. I, I will have my timer. Give me a second to go ahead and... Find my timer. We should here. get a uh, sand. Ready, timer. ready, ready, ready. That's a minute. Go ahead, and we're this going to go mess. ahead and start. There we go. Flamecraft is going to be a game where on your turn you're going to grab one of your little dragons and you're going to visit a shop. You're going to pick any shop on the board, at least not the one that you started in. You're going to go there. If other dragons are present, you're going to pay their owner a good. From there, you're going to do one of two things. You'll either gather or enchant. When you gather, you're going to gather the resource from the shop. Then you're going to go ahead and place a dragon. You can activate any one dragon and you get to perform the shop ability. So a little bit of stuff going on at the shop. Alternatively, you can enchant where you're going to give up the resources on any one of the enchantments over here, find one matching the shop you're visiting, placing it at the shop, and then activating all the dragons at that shop, plus of course getting the various points from your uh, enchantment over there. Past that, when your turn ends, if you filled up one of the locations on the board, you're going. If you filled up the, any one of the shops, you're going to add new shops to the board to various locations. 14 shops max. A few other things to be mindful of. There's going to be a bunch of dragons. Six basic types will give you everything you need. There's going to be these dragons over here that are going to give you points, different end game or mid game scoring. Coins are going to be wild as a resource, as well as be worth a point at the end of the game. And that's basically Flamecraft. Oh, one second too quick. I saw you going for the end, but... Oh, come on. Didn't quite oh, come there. on. Leave a comment down below how you're disappointing that he cheaped out on the last second of that overview. And also, feel free to comment, this video is a mess, because it really actually bugs him a little bit. We're trying to get more does. formulated and structured, but he seemed to have lost the idea. This is Quackalope. We don't quite do that. You can do what you want. And with that being I'm said, just a where's the flavor text? The flavor text! Sure. I need it. Uh, which page was it on? And do left? your most dragony voice. What is a dragony no. voice? No, she's got it. Watch. Nope. Artisan dragons, the smaller and magically talented versions of their larger and destructive cousins, are sought by shopkeepers so that they may delight customers with their flame craft. You are a flame keeper, skilled in the art of conversing with dragons, placing them in their ideal home, and using enchantments to entice them to produce wondrous things. Your reputation will grow as you aid the dragons and shopkeepers, and the flame keeper with the most reputation will be known as the master of flame craft. That was epic. It's beautiful. But dragony voice, fantastic. Now, when I hear dragony voice can be a throwback to some people. I think of Sean Connery. Do you know what I'm talking about? I don't know who No he idea is. what you're talking about. Dragonheart. Who is The he? voice? Who's Young he? whippersnapper. My name's Sean Connery and I'm a dragon. I can't do Sean Connery. What's that from? It's from a movie called Dragonheart. Never watched yeah. it. Sender, I'm trying oh. to keep on track here. This is messy. This is also going to be a prototype copy that we have in front of us. So while some of the artwork and everything is reminiscent of what will be in that final game, uh, Cardboard Alchemy did want to make sure that they were clear that the components, the items, even the artwork is still being finalized, redesigned, and drawn as we approach that final produced product. So you can see uh, every everything, for instance, will have a cloth playmat, but the version that we have here won't be reminiscent of what the final version yep. will be, along with 
you know, cute little uh, resin minis and pieces of uh, items and gear and tokens, like all of these will actually be all of these. But for now, there are placeholders, short one is, these. and then the other resource type. Can we start playing? Yes, we can. Who wants to go first? We didn't really talk about that. Sure, why don't you go first? Why don't I go first? Yes. All right, well. Or if I'm certain, I can jump straight in. I don't have any resources, so I think I'm going to pass go the eagles, by the way? I'm going to take a look at my cards, and then I'm going to go visit a shop. Sounds good. I'm trying to see where all these shops are. All right, I'm going to go here to Draco Bell. Draco Bell. And then I just play a card, and based on that is what I get. So when you go here, you're first going to gather all listed resources in the shop. So you're mm -hmm. going to go ahead and gain some meat. You're then going to go ahead and place down a dragon, if you'd like, and you'll gain the reward in the location that you placed it. So two victory points, uh, a, what's this, meat, steel, and well, the, some the, the, magic the, the, card. The middle thing is going to be the requirement type, so you have to play a dragon of uh, that type, and then the highlighted part is the reward. Uh, so a coin, a magic card, like a, a, a scoring card, yeah. or two victory points for meat or steel dragons. Cool. All right, and then I'm going to place this here. Smoky. So I get another meat. So you get two meat, basically. Oh, no, you get one meat. No, you don't yes. get the resource in the... No, because you gather first, then you place a dragon. That's sad. It is sad. All right. Life is I full of I do get two things. points, though. So one, two. And then place another dragon and gain one. So what are the coins for? Can you The coins elaborate? are coins are going to be wild as a resource. You can trade them in at any point, Ooh. for instance, for enchantments. They're also worth a point at the end of the game. Okay, and nice. your third action will be to trigger a Wait. dragon's ability here, not place another one. This says place another dragon. Oh, you're reading yes. the ability. <laughs> so yes, that that will be the always the three action. steps ahead. Yeah, it's crazy, <laughs> crazy. How crazy, do you get crazy. more of these cards? Uh, those you have to find abilities that will give you them. Oh, that's sad. Look, yeah, I skipped eighth grade and dropped out in twelfth. Right, so then I'm gonna put this here and gain. What? <laughs> place another dragon. Okay. Gain a coin. I don't think I get to activate the next ability. No. I gained a coin. And then can I please no, you have? Can, you, oh, you can activate. No, no. Can no. I please have two blue cards? You may have two blue cards. When you get a blue symbol, you take two and pick one. Yes, you do. And uh, finally, you'd be able to perform any shop abilities. This shop, as a starting shop, does, does not, not have any. any. Okay. And those shops were filled. And so. from there, it will be my turn. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna place my dragon on the Hello Nursery. I'm going to gather one of these resources here. I'm going to place this dragon down over here, which probably is, you know, better situated. The I like where you set down. up the coins. I didn't think about the impact of the dragons. It, it kind of worked when I did it. Uh, that's gonna be, I'm gonna go ahead and place that down. That's going to give me draw two cards and pick one. So I'm gonna What's do that. What's endgame triggered by? Endgame is triggered by either of these decks running out. Cool. Okay, uh, then I'm going to grab one of these. Ooh, that's interesting. Ooh. Oh, I like that as an intriguing concept. I'm gonna grab this Can card you over put here. This underneath? Yep. Okay. Oh, I don't actually know if they go underneath now. I'm thinking about it. I'll oh, check that in a second. Probably not because yeah, because if it triggers end game. Trigger end game. I'll check that in a second. Uh, and then I am going to go ahead and draw one dragon from the park, where I will draw a dragon. Haven't thought about which one I'm going to draw. I'm gonna draw Rusty. Um, actually, like Shale. They're exactly. Ooh, actually, Ash. Those three were exactly the same, but they have delightful artwork in them. <laughs> and then I'm going to go ahead and replace that dragon in the park with a dandelion. Oh, adorable. Cute. Your turn. Okay. Uh, I think... Now, if I go to a location that you all have already gone to, I have to give you a gift when I go there. Yes, you and do. I have no gifts to Correct. currently hand out. So I think... I'm going to go up here to Dunkin' Dragons. Uh... And I'm do gonna, indeed go to the bottom of the deck. I'm going to go ahead and huh. gain a bread. So then how is in-game entry? You can still hypothetically grab them. Still, have, the deck could still be depleted. It just takes longer. Wow. Okay, I'm going to uh, gain a bread. Then I'm going to place a dragon. Do I have any bread dragons? I do have. This is a pumpernickel dragon, which cool. is adorable. We're gonna go right here over this location. Do I gain victory points or do I go for scoring right now? I think I'm gonna go over this location, and I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing you two did, which is draw up two cards and bring one into my hand, and then after that I'll be able to perform the shop ability. There's no shop ability, so that would be the end of my turn. Okay. Share it to your turn. Very nice. I am trying to see... So, what's considered the park? The park? That's yes. That's a great question. I do not know the answer to that. The park, what does it say? Swap with a dragon in town or park. Oh, this is the park. That's the park. Gotcha. Okay. So, I'm gonna go here. Okay. I get a 
white resource. And then if I put this down here. An uh, elderberry. Gain all of that, place this optional and gain the reward. So it says I can swap with a dragon in town or part and then use its ability. Do I have to, does the symbol have to match? Not if you're swapping. I don't believe so. Nope. Nope. You hear, you hear the I, question though? Because no, I just handed in a card that would have benefited an entire thing being filled up with you the same dragon, match. and I was curious how that would happen. It turns out Elderberry. They give a specific play example, it does not have to match. It does not have to match. Perfect. So I am going to swap it with Pomber Nickel. That. Okay. Toast. And then I get to draw one from the park. Which one would you like? Can I please have a purple? Purple. That's going to be one purple. You have Thistle. You're now the proud owner of Thistle. Um, I like and we that. have Jasmine coming out. Oh, I kind of want Jasmine. And then there's no shop abilities. So it is your turn. It is indeed my turn. Um, I believe. Oh, so interesting. So it's an interesting little puzzle in the sense that you're going to have more and more goods being generated every mm -hmm. single round. So I think I Everywhere would like you're going. To, oh, yeah. and then I went here so I get another coin. I think I'm going to go to uh, Draco Bell over here and I'm going to, well, first I'm going to move my meeple there. Gain your resources. I'm going to gain three meat. Can you pass me three meat? Sure. It's a lot of meat. It's a lot of meat. I'm hungry. Okay. Uh, so then we're going to go ahead and place down the dragon. We're going to gain two of the uh, two items of the type of any dragon here, including itself. I'm going to take two of those, two steel. If you go here, though, you're not going to be able to go to Dunkin' Donuts. That's okay. Can I have two steel? What do you mean? What are you What are you talking about? We well, got a five and a half hour window before you can go there. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> you're the worst. <laughs> okay. Uh, and then perform shop ability of any, which is not relevant. And so that was my turn. Oh, did I get the word? I got a coin. <laughs> Wait I got a there coin first. Good choice, good choice, Jesse. Your turn, Shira. <laughs> no, it's not your nope. turn. It's my turn. How it, dare you skip me? You filled up me? a town slot. You have to mm. put on oh, a new town a new location. Thank you. Thank you. We have Outback, Outback Drake House. Drake House. <laughs> That's hilarious. Place an extra dragon, ignoring type, then gain double hearts or coins listed. Yes, Ooh. that's the last thing you do. That's the, that's the ability, what? so it's the last thing you do. That's what? awesome. I kind of want to go and there. And this symbol, in case you're wondering, means any dragon can go there. I sort of want to go there. Do I go, go there. Oh, yeah. Outback Drake House. I'm going to get a meat. Uh, I'm going to place a dragon and gain the reward. Uh, we're going to put down... Oh, this is good. We're going to put down Opal Wing. Opal Wing is going to allow me to gain... First of all, you get two reputation. Two reputation, yes. Two uh, reputation. Two reputation. Which is more than I Place currently have. Place dragon, get two reputation. Gain three different um, items, right? Do I get to do that now? Yes, you do. Okay. How, how, how can I get three different items? Where you are my just items? choose all those items. Is this three? This is three. That's no fair. I got some meat. I got some bread so far. Ooh, do I want to double in on something big? When it says your limit for items is seven, does that include coins? No, coins are always uh, unlimited. Everything else is a max of seven. Let me actually go. So I got a steel and two bread, steel and then one. I get to do the activation here, which is place an extra dragon ignoring type, gain double I hearts, see what you're going for. or coins listed. Please give me six hearts and shorties popping down. Shorties popping down? What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, six, six hearts. Go ahead. Yeah. How do you get six hearts? Double. That one's worth three. Oh, man. Yep. That's okay. a lot. It's now going to be your turn, Shira. Well, you guys are taking all the good spots. Mm, you could go here and give me a gift. I don't want to give you a gift. <laughs> I'm going. That is not the way this game's played. I'm going over there. I am putting down Cinnabon. I am getting a coin for going there. A purple. And can I please have a green leaf? Green leaf. There you go. And then... Do, do, perform, gain the reward, and then place that perform a shop ability. It does not have a shop ability. However, I can draw one dragon from the park. Can I? Green, two blues, a green, and a jasmine. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Can I have a green, please? A green, a green, green, green? Actually, no, not a green. I want a blue. A Thank blue you. dragon? Yep. Here you go. Thank you. Okay. Your turn. Sender. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and place a new card out. Uh, I think where I want to go. Did you shuffle that deck? Absolutely. I shuffle that deck. I see no gems I hear coming out or I respect, yellows. I respect your lack of seeing those gems or yellows. 
don't know if it matters much, but I respect it. Also, you're in last place. I'd just like to point that out. On that track? Yes. Oh, please. There's no last place. Unless you think There's always last place. There's there actually an alternative no win condition. Place. If he goes backwards and passes <laughs> us, I am going to go ahead and put Cookie down in Duncan Dragons. Well, I'm going to visit Duncan Dragons first. So if you go ahead and put me Duncan Dragons. And so then am I still allowed to go here? To get the resources, and yes, you just yes, can't put down absolutely. the dragon. Yep. You'd be able to activate. I'm gonna the go ahead and put then. down the dragon, the card up there. Okay, and that in the heart slot. So can you give me two hearts? Oh, I'm also okay taking you. two of these. Now, now who's in last place? Uh, then I'm gonna go ahead and activate the dragon. Either the dragon's there. In this case, I'm gonna draw a dragon from the park, and I think I'm going to take. Oh, you can activate either. Yeah, any any one dragon doesn't be the one you play. Interesting. And I'm going to grab Shale over there, and then I'm going to put on a new dragon, and that's going to be my turn. Okay, thank you for opening up Draco Bell. Heading over there, double meat, triple meat, single iron. Uh, I don't get to play a dragon. Do you know what dragon. he's going to do next? He's going to go for the dwarven stout. Who, me? Him. Mm, I hear you. Uh, so I... if you wanted to take it before it got to oh, him. Oh, please, I welcome him taking dwarven stout. What are you going for? I'm not telling you that. I don't see it. Gain plus two items at the shop or dragon type here. What does it mean, or dragon type here? I could gain a dragon? No, no, no. So plus it's plus two items of either the shop or dragon type. Oh. So do you want more grain, more meat? Could I play a dragon somewhere that I'm not? I don't believe so. Okay, hand bone. <laughs> All right, fine. I'll take double potion. Okay. Okay. Yep. And your turn, sure. Yes, it is. I need to get coins. Where do I get coins? By placing fun things. I'm going to go here. Okay. So I get a gem and two meat. Yep. Gem and two meat. And then I covered up this. So can you please hand me... Two of these. Two of those. Yes, I will choose in a moment. And then I also so gain all of those, place and gain the reward. Form an action there. I am going to gain three different items. Go for it. I would like, can I please have three green? Three green. Uh, three green. Here you go. Thank you. And then I filled up a shop. Yes. So, oh, and I can do the shop's ability. Place an extra dragon. Oh, I Not can't. Not relevant. Yeah. Sadly. Okay. Can you please place out a new shop? You choose where a shop goes. Um, well, it doesn't matter. It might matter for various cards and things. I don't know. Okay. Drake, Drake of, of Cakes. cakes. Pay two to draw two park dragons. Ooh, intriguing. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. I have that, I have that. I have all these kinds of things over here, but I want more. I want more. Okay. I think that I will de make decisions about stuff and the universe and things. I can hear it in your voice. You're making decisions. That's what I'm saying right there. Yeah. Right, I'm going to head on over here to Hello Nursery. Here. I'm going to... Can you please place this? Okay. Uh, can you go ahead and give me uh, my dragon on Hello Nursery? And I'm going to go ahead and place this here. I'm going to get one of these and one of these and keep past me one um, purple. Why? Because this one oh, over here. Oh, you didn't place that down. Yep. Okay, then I'm going to grab those over here. Then I'm going to place down this. I'm going to take two hearts. Can you give me two hearts? Okay. And then I could draw an item from the park, which could be useful. I like the idea of doing that there. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and draw this getting cutlet. What happens if you can't do anything on your turn? Mm, then sadness prevails. Okay. Oh, let me put this out, and then it's your turn, Jesse. Okay. <sighs> I'm moving up to the Smith Market. I'm going to go ahead and play a dragon down, which is going to be Lotus. I'm going to activate that dragon's ability. Oh, and I get one iron for that. I'm going to activate dragon's ability to give someone a gift. He's got an awful lot of stuff. No, no, no. Sender? Yes. 
I'll give you a meat. Thank Why? You, sir. I'm gonna gain a coin because you got three wilds over there. That was the deciding factor. Mm, I hear you. He has so many more resources no, than I no, do. No, 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 no. That. That just made me sad. I believe is going to be the end turn. You okay. What does this symbol mean? That's wild. Any dragon go there. Ooh. Sure, it's your turn. Interesting. All right. I am going to go I need more dragons. here. I know you do. Ah, oh, give all players at that shop. I am actually, yeah, I'm going to go there. I am going to play, the, I get a, can I please have a yellow? A yellow? Yellow what? Resource? Yellow resource. Okay. Oh. And then gain plus two items of the shop or dragon type. Here I'm going to gain two more yellows. Two more yellows, nice. And then I'm going to pay two yellows to draw two from the park. Seems can reasonable. Can I please have a... Do you refill it in between the two? No, you do not. Fine. Can I have a green and purple? Green and purple. The selection was amazing. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and draw two out. They're gonna be green and purple. No, it's not close. <laughs> we got a jewel heart. You didn't shuffle. I shuffle. Oh, we have espresso. Espresso. Oh, adorable. I want espresso. Always, I want espresso. Okay, it is my this turn. Is so cute. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna get three red. Can you pass me three red, Shira, and one steel. Okay. That's going to be that. You may notice that I now have seven of a type, which is still within the required restriction. I can also gain two more of a type. I'm going to take two steel. That's ridiculous. It and is ridiculous. Then I believe that's my turn. Done. Okay. We're going to see an enchant action. Moving down to the mm. portable potions. I was waiting. We're going to enchant the dwarf stout. So pay items listed on enchant that matches the current shop's thing. So two red, three bread. One dead. That rhymed. I figured you're gonna go for some sort of rhyme at the end. Just the way you said that. <laughs> Sounded like a you thing. Uh, I'm gonna gain six victory points, please. Six little hearts. Ooh, six hearts are beautiful. Go ahead and give the man six hearts. Dwarven stout sticks in there. Ten to sixteen. And I'm gonna go That's ahead. That's nauseating. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. I'm actually paying 16. a yeah. coin instead of one of those bread. Uh, because. On your turn, enchant a shop using only one coin. And get five points. And get five more points. Please yep. give me five points? more yep. points. I thought you said coins. I said coin, but I meant points. Um, can you cycle around the track? You oh. absolutely can. Yes, of course. So end game is just triggered by a deck running out. Yes, indeed. And activate all yep. dragons running, here. I, I don't imagine this deck runs out very often. Although it could be that when they said deck running out, they meant this deck or this deck. They said when either of the decks, not oh. any. They said either. Shop location dragons yeah. as opposed gotcha. to scoring objectives. Yeah. So, so they the just last. said either. All right. And then are you finishing up your turn? Um, the end of my turn would have been to activate all dragons below, which is a tragic oversight on my behalf. Absolutely. Because if you do that at a location, you get so much stuff happening. Oh, I know. That's why when she said you're going for that enchantment, I was like, please you do. Said, I There's don't care. nowhere for you to go that will be beneficial. Your turn, sure. I now understand. All right. On that note, I'm going up here. Mm hmm And I'm going to do an enchant. I would like empanadas. Empanadas, and you're paying yes. everything for it. Yeah, you're basically giving you're giving places recipes that they can. Uh... Four. Although this is, is that actually, the max? yeah, four and four is the max. I got to be honest, this is actually quite a tragic recipe. And Empanadas. Four? Oh what, wow. Meat and lettuce. I mean, you are 100 percent baking imps. It's, it's not. Oh imp. Haha, <laughs> imps. That's funny. I don't get it. Maybe there's an imp. Empanadas. They're not empanadas. Yeah. Imps. I don't know what an imp is. It's a tiny little it's, like elf-like creature, isn't what? it? Yeah. It's know. a little. It's it's it like a, it's like a pixie. It's, an it's like a fairy, but it does know. mean things. All right. Yeah. Now and you're banking them into Nadas. So you get eight points for that. Make sure I to take those. It. Beautiful. And then you get to activate all of the dragons at the location. It says wait, add and gain the listed rewards. What was the listed? Oh, the listed rewards. Um, the points. Yep. And then activate all the dragons here. Do I activate these? The shop? Uh, no. You just activate the dragons. Okay. So okay, I have please two more yellow. Two more. That's yellows. pretty nice. Wait, no, no, no. Do you activate the abilities? Yeah, the, the abilities. abilities. abilities yes. Oh, you draw two more cards, yes. Oh, that's even nicer. Can it I please is. have the diamond? And can I please have a purple? I'm going to give you Jasmine because I want espresso. Uh, <laughs> actually, do I want one second, please? And we should have one can of these I up, actually by the please way. have the green? Green. You can have mulch. There Thanks. you go. 
And now it's my turn. So I haven't fully finished thinking on my turn, but I'm mostly there. Okay, on my turn, I'm going to go ahead and move to Outback Steakhouse. I'm going to pay in, like all of you, I'm going to pay in four now you're and four. everything. What are you making? You're making yep. the Displacer Beer? I'm making beef? the Smoked Gorgon. The Smoked Gorgon. Okay, that's going to be eight points for me, sure, if you don't mind. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's gonna go here, that's gonna go here, uh, that's gonna go there. Can you please put these greens back uh, over yes, there? Indeed. Hey, okay. Jim, so got I any of that smoke gorgon eight today? Eight points for that, and I get to activate all of the three people. Now, Shorty won't be activatable because the place is already full. Um, I don't mind the idea of Rusty over there because I can swap a dragon in. Could you do the swap before you activate Shorty? It won't, it won't make a difference. This is not gonna be space either way. You're still swapping it in. Oh, swap with the down, oh, or with Park. Um, swap with the dragon. I don't care about any of these things. Swap with the dragon in town. Couldn't you do Thistle to bring in Ash and How then help? activate Ash's ability? I could, but I can't do. Shorty's no. still there. Shorty's still there. Shorty's not being activated. Shorty's not moving. Either way, you swap Thistle. I am going to go ahead. Oh. Given my dragon situation over I here, see. I'm going to go ahead and let me just check what I have. Okay, I have that. I have that. Not the things I want. So I'm going to start by taking. I am going to swap in Ash because I do need something. So I'm going to swap in Ash like so. And then we're going to use Ash to grab, I'm going to use Opal Wing to grab, ooh, I just need to think about this. There should be another card over here. No, because it's the end of my turn. Uh, okay. What's underneath Lotus? Lotus? What do you mean? What's the symbol this? under, no, over there? This? Like under, Too lift hot. up the card. How did someone oh, that's play a fair point. How did someone play that there? Definitely couldn't. No have. one should have played that. Who played yeah. there? I played that there. Of course you did. Okay, we're <laughs> so going to go. Cheated? We're going to keep it anyway because at this point it's too late. Uh, I was in the middle of gaining some items and thinking through my turn and taking Sorry, too long. Sorry, I just noticed that. Um, and I was wondering no, who cheated. No, it's all good. It's well, all good. I was focused on the coin. See, so cheated. Okay. Very, I am going to the nice following. Time. So I can take a bunch of things over here. So what I'm going to take is I'm going to grab uh, two of Ash's things. Here we go. And then I'm going to grab, with Oak Wing, I'm going to grab. Uh, let's say two, three of plants, or two plants and a gem. I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just trying to figure it out. Okay, cool. And that is my turn. And it's your turn, Shira. Nope. Jesse. You keep skipping me. I do. Right, Felisa. So, I um, have we put out another dragon for when Hella Nursery was filled? We should have another no. shop. There should be another shop. Mm -hmm. Flagons and dragons. Get anything. Pay one coin to all dragons here, or gain one coin per dragon here. Interesting. Why would you want to pay? To Wait. activate. Pay one coin to activate all dragons oh. here. Oh. Okay. Interesting. I need some dragons. So we're... Going to need some dragons. We're going to go here. I get a steel. I get a bread. Uh... I got no dragons, so I can't. I can gain, though. Gain two items, the shop or dragon type here. I'll gain two more bread. I'm going to spend those bread immediately to gain two dragons. Please give me... No. Oh, that should be a point please, of please give me a meat. Hot dog. Give me hot dog and espresso. Hot dog and... You took my espresso on purpose. You did it on purpose. You know Jasmine's right there. You don't care. You don't care, you animal. Is it my turn now? Yes. All right. I don't like stuff that's happening. I hear you. I don't like stuff that's happening either. So. I will go. Interesting. It's all the symbols, and they all give you two mm. points. That's so cool. All right. Sorry, I'm just thinking. Can away, you move away. me down to portable potions? Oh. Whatever that says, I can't read that. Which one? Pot 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 potable potions. Potable potions. Very nice. I would like to. No, I don't want to place that down. Okay, I want to place this down. Okay. Also, Could you how do you. Do you need a resource? Um, no, in the middle section, please. Or actually, no points. One, two. I did not gain the resources, so I would get the two purple and a green. Who who else played down a green and got two? No, I, m I moved the green. No, but I'm saying there was only one. There was only one gift giving. Did you ignore that part? What do you mean one gift giving? The green ability is give an item to another player mm -hmm. and gain two points. No, no, no. So, so this green was here. Right, but, but it there's could've, two it greens. I only remember you doing that. Oh, he played but activated a different dragon. Oh. Yeah. Gotcha. Are you are you allowed to activate the dragon that you have? 
Yes, you can activate the dragon that you played or any of the other ones that are there. A dragon and then activate it. I would like to swap Cosmo with. There we go. That and there. And then gain three different items. And that shop does not have an ability. So, can I all take one, two, and then. Yeah, okay. So. Also, there's also the enchantment deck. That can be empty first as well. Mm -hmm. I don't oh, know. There's a decks. lot of decks. Yeah, a lot of decks. Yeah. Okay. They may have just said either one, they meant any. My turn, sure? Yes. Okay. I think I am going to go ahead to Duncan Dragons. Or they could have meant either with these two, assuming that that one will just I hear you. I hear you. I'm still going to Duncan Dragons. I'm going to enchant it. So I am activating this Fairy Jubilee card over here, which is going to be a uh, three steel and two of the green stuff, and then I'm going to put that under it as well. So you can go ahead and add that recipe. I get four points, if you don't mind, as well as three I mean, I mind different dragons. Bit. What happens if I mind? Uh, that still happens. Okay. Then I get three different dragons. So what does that mean? What, what does what mean? Why four points and three dragons? Because it says, well, like, activate these two cards. Oh, draw one from yep. the park, one from the park, and then one from here. Yes, correct. Gotcha. So I get one, and That's one, intense. and then I guess let's go with uh, Jasmine over here. Jasmine, that, there we go. And then we put out three new cards. And that, you move up four points? Three. three uh, how dare you, sir. And, that's, and then before that's done, I'm going to go ahead and pay five red in. It's gonna be one, two, three, four, five red, and get five more points. So I go up another one, two, three, four, five. Look at that, Jesse. Hi, Hi buddy. Hi. Hi. How's it going there? I missed you. I missed Did you too. You? No. All right, Jesse, I think it's your turn. It is your turn. I'll show sure you how to put this away. I understand what you're saying. Do you though? I do. Do you do you do? I do. The issue. If anyone wants like a lot of bread, then you go to Dunkin' Dragons, which seems about right, honestly. So Thematically, much bread. that's appropriate. So much bread. I'm getting a gem. I'm getting a toast. Uh, do I want to place a dragon and gain the reward? I kind of do. I kind of don't, if I'm going to be honest about it. Um, I think I don't. Can I please have. A yellow dragon from the park. You may have a yellow dragon from the park. Thank you so much. I got honey. Adorable. Honey, honey, honey. And then honey. perform a shop honey, ability. That's it. Okay. Honey. Okay. Sure to you. Yes. Where's my symbol? Where's I... my... Fill my cup. Fill my cup. I think I'm gonna go... Here. Seems reasonable. I believe that... Actually... I'm gonna go up here. I am going to enchant. Can I please have the Wraith Rose? The Wraith Rose. So, three diamonds, two bread, and what was the other one? A purple. Purple, a coin, and can you... All right, so, pay items I did. That gives me eight points, 20, and then and the enchantment, and then activate all dragons here. Give an item to another player and gain two points. I will give, what is not helpful? <laughs> I love the requirements there. What's not helpful? How can I not help people? <laughs> you know what, you were mean in the beginning. Oh, so, he's winning. No, yes, no, no. I'm, un I'm just, un here, look. I gained two points. Now you're winning, there you go. Oh. Now she's winning. Two, actually winning. Well, at least she didn't give the gift to herself. My turn. <laughs> Swap with a th uh, thing in town, and then what's the one that allows you to dr draw dragons? I will. I'll actually swap this with this. I okay. Like, I like that diamond. Yeah, the, the people keep swapping the opal wing around. Like opal wing, come on over here. Can I please have a red dragon? Red dragon, red dragon. In there. Oh. Sorry. And then... Oh, this game's going to be over soon. Mm-hmm. Assuming either of these decks means any of these decks, we have three more cards. I will do that, and then gain three different items. What do I want? Each player will get one more turn. To get. Including the player with trigger the end. This was eight, right? Yeah, it says either oh, deck. Oh, six, not eight. One, two. Oh, how dare you. Was the other one that I did eight? I don't know. Which one did I do? That you did the first one in that shop. Did I? Yeah. Oh, that was it. Yes. Because mm, she spent a lot of resources yep. for it. I did. 
Um, and then I, I'm just using my resources. My I turn get three then? resources, you can go. Okay. Then. I'm going to go ahead and move Capacity My Dragon up there. I'm moving down to Dwarven Stout, where I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to play this item down over here. Well, first, I'm going to go ahead and take the goods. So I'm going to take one, two, three, and one. That's going to be that. Oh, interesting. You kind of messed me up a bit there. That's fine. Can I have three purple? Okay. Uh, then I'm going to go ahead and go over here to there, and I'm placing that down, which lets me draw two cards from the deck and keep one of these. And that's an interesting way to go. Oh, interesting. Okay, I like that. I'm missing. I'm going to go ahead and keep this, okay? Everything for all the recipes at the moment. Then I'm going to go ahead and activate one card. I think I'm going to take a no Q from Shira's book. Or I could just do that. Hmm. Nothing I have to. So I'm going to go ahead and swap this with this. Yeah. And activate that. Of course. And I'm going to go ahead and take... It's uh, too good. I'll take three... Hmm. Oh, interesting. Can I get away with that? No, I don't think I can. Oh, interesting. So I'm not gonna. I may not bother doing that. One second. What are, What are you doing? I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I had a plan. You messed it up. That's all. That's it's all you need to know. Common. That's all you need to know. Why are you thinking so hard? That's all you need to know. Okay. I don't like how this played out. I could do that, and then that. Fine. I'm still gonna do that, and then I'm just gonna go ahead, head, and take uh, three, two of this, and. Let's go with one more of that. Okay, great. I'm done. Okay, I'm gonna flip, flop, flap my way over here to. Oh wait, wait, no, no. Shop has been filled. We have tip the scales. Pay, Pay two, two to convert unique items one to one. Pay two two gems to convert any unique item at a one to one ratio. Cool. Oh, into oh into hearts. Into mm -hmm. points. Oh, that's intriguing. That's the problem. As you look down at your resources. At my giant pool of So it doesn't mean unique, you can only do one of each yeah. type. For the cost of two, you can do one type, yeah. Oh, one type? Yeah. Or one? I think a unique item would be one of each type. That's yeah. how I was understanding it. No. Or would it be one, one per type? Unique, unique item. Convert a singular item at a one-to-one -one ratio. Oh. Okay. Uh, I can see it written both ways, so. Prototype. You went over to Drake. I did. I did. I am going to be playing a... So first I get bread and, and steel. I'm going to be paying an additional bread at the end of this. So two bread, of course. But I'm also going to be playing down. Game? I'm going to be playing down honey to go over here to gain three points. I'm going to be drawing two cards up. Uh, did he just trigger endgame? Yeah, no, one yet. more card actually, because now he triggered endgame. I did one for honey, two for the location, and we all have one turn left. Okay, so the last card is now one, two, three, which means now we all have one turn, including Jesse. Including him? Including him. Yeah. I don't like that. That's the upside of triggering endgame. I don't like that. I don't like any of you right now. I don't particularly like Jesse either. That's what you're talking about, right? We're talking about not liking Jesse? No, all of you. Mm, why all of us? What does he do? What do I do? All right, give me a second. You just messed up my plans. <laughs> <laughs> Royally. Royally, royally. Was not a carbon was alchemy. We apologize in advance for whatever she rates this game. It's not your fault. It's Jesse's. Yes, that will be very true. She is not the most charitable loser. No, she's not. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, the first game on my channel that she won, it was like a five second moment of silence, and then she just goes, na 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 na. All right. Sounds about right. So settle down, <laughs> gentlemen. Are resources worth anything? In the end. Not at all. Uh, I don't believe uh, so, no. Can I take a coin for the wild? Uh, coins are going to be worth coins, and then you're no, going to no, cash in any this. dragons. I, yeah. I can get a wild. I don't believe so, because it's a six-sided thing. It doesn't show coins. Okay. Uh, Reasonable question. Uh, there are six of those. Fine. And okay. there's definitely a simple okay. four coins. Yes. I will place this over here, which gives me two, two hearts. points. I'm white. One, two. And then I can place another and get one, heart. one or... Yeah, I don't get the ability. Yeah, in that case, by the way, I'm curious. I can't see a reason why you would never choose to take a coin over hearts. Coins are hearts in the game. Yeah, and in the meantime, they give you flexibility. Yeah. So, Unless I'm missing something about the game and maybe having a rotation and stuff like that, I'm seeing no reason why you would ever take a heart over a coin. I will place this, and I will take a coin. Uh, 
I did not choose a wild resource. Not that it really matters. It might. Can I have... I wonder if you, either of you have something that gives you things for stuff. I'm saying there are cards that will give you of having the most. What if Jesse has the most steel? And you, or what if Jesse has the most? Is there anything you can deny him the most of? I don't know. Can't deny him the most of steel because he's got four. I only get one. I could None deny you could. of purple, which I don't think you're about to spend. I don't think you're going for it. Mm. I'll take a steel. All right. Yeah, okay. Is it my turn? Mm hmm. Cool. Well, my turn's plans may or may not have shifted a drop. I don't love that. There needs that. to be more dragons. Cool. I'm going to go ahead and I will move over here, I believe, because I see no reason not to. Uh, we're going to go to the following. We're going to go ahead and buy this displacer beef over here. That's going to cost me three of these and two of these. So I'm going to go ahead and put those up there for right now. That's going to give me four points and a dragon. Not that the dragons are worth anything other than the game, but we'll go ahead and take the four. One, two, three, four. I'll also take a dragon. I'll take Frostfire just so just can't have them. Then I'm going to go ahead and activate all of these. I'm going to go ahead and swap Costco to, let's see, Olive. Let's go to Olive over here. And we're going to swap that over there. And then we're going to go ahead and give Shiro something. We'll give Shiro anything we can deny you. What did you end up taking in the end? Oh, I wish I, took I had a steel. I wish I had a steel so I could deny you Same. a steel, but I can't. Oh, wait. I'm going to first activate this to take two steel, and then I'm going to give you a steel just in case he has that card. Yep. Um, and then I take two more points. One, two. I hope you lose from that. I hope you lose. Uh, and then that, I believe, is going to be my turn. I think he'll okay. do something this turn to I'm get more I'm moving up to bread. Dunkin' Dragons, where I started. I get all the bread in the world, but I don't <laughs> necessarily need unless that card's like, do all the bread. Ooh, but that card is do some of the meat. I feel like you should have points for all the dragons. I ended up with six dragons in my hand. Well, watch this. He's going to do the creme brulee. Um, what are you doing? I'm drawing up a dragon. Why? I go to this location. I get all the bread in. Oh, I'm you're not, gathering? You're not I'm not filling? placing down a dragon. I end with six in my hand, which is going to trigger this card, which is going to give me five victory points. Nice. Okay. Game's not over yet. Well, we have we track oh. coins. Yeah, yes. sure. Go ahead and track track trade in coins. It's one for one. Is there one end game one. scoring? Yeah, coins mm. and these. Oh, I tragically one. messed up. Two. I thought I had it. No. Um, that's oh. my last sure, story. That's all I have left. I get eight more points. Sure, gets eight more what? points. What? One, two. No, three, I thought four, I had five, it. Six, seven, eight. I love it. What, what did you get? What did you get? So this, if the town has at least four, gain one point for each. So that's why I specifically went here. Okay. Um, oh wait, nice. did it not have another red? Oh, oh. four. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Perfect. Then the green, I put another green down so there would be four green. One, one two, two, three, three four. four. Nice. Sadly, I couldn't get the blue. There's only two blues. So you got eight points for that. Nice. And yes. I'm going to get for this one two points if you have three green, which I do, and another three points more if I have the most green, which I do. That's going to be five points for me. One, two, three, four, five. And then this one's going to get one point for every dragon on one side of town that's filled. One, two, three. What? One, two, three. Jesse comes in at a nice solid third place, which is not bad. Third place is nothing you're ashamed of. People go on podiums for third place, Jesse. Except in a three-player game, it's last oh. place. Oh, that That's is awkward. your fault for ending it mm. early. He pulled a crumb. and pulled a Victor crumb. <sighs> Ended the game on his terms and lost. Yes. Maybe I'm not that too much of a good winner either. Okay. So I apologize on behalf of <laughs> Alex and Shira for what I'm going to rate this game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are we jumping into the review, or is that a separate video? I, typically what we do is a gameplay on this channel, and then yep. over on Board Game Co., we do final thoughts, overview, reviews. Yep. So swing over there, make sure you're subscribed. We're going to be doing more coverage here. You probably already saw a preview video of this uh, on Quackalope, and if you want to see more gameplay and potentially me try to win, make sure you leave a comment down below. Whatever the case. He won't win. Whatever you do. <laughs> Never. Remember to do the important thing. Let's get something with dragons. Get out and play some games. And ride some dragons. We'll see you next time. Thank you. Question? Are you questioning them? Your endings are so awkward. <laughs>